What's up everybody? This is Victor on the Let Me Explain show and today I would like to talk about this small camera. Yep, it's not a GoPro. It's um, a ripoff of a GoPro. And this is called the HD 10, 1080p. That's the name of the camera. I thought that was um, a spec you most cameras usually have. But in any case, um, just buy a Go GoPro. It's just this is just not worth it. The image quality is decent. It's not exactly 10H 1080p. You can definitely tell that it's um it's been bumped up um, by software, and um, it just doesn't give you the same quality you would get from a GoPro. Even a second generation GoPro can kick this thing's butt. So. Why I bought it is because I wanted a, a small camera I could move around with um, at a low cost, but costs translated to a bad image. And in low light, this thing does just does not hold up. It really does not hold up. Image stabilization in this thing is also terrible. So shooting on the go is not the best, though they say it is a sports camera. I don't think um, it it's compares to the GoPro in any way, shape or form. So once again, this is another review to say, just buy a GoPro. This um, camera will do if you want basic f um, footage that's not high quality. Sound quality is, it's decent. It's not it's not high quality sound. It's not what we call high fidelity sound, um, and so. My recommendation is that if you're looking for a small camera that's um, more like a GoPro, just buy a GoPro. Even a, a, an earlier generation GoPro will do so much better than these gimmicks that come out um, um, in imitating GoPros. It has a fisheye lens, so every video you shoot will have that curved look to it, wide angle look to it. Some people like it, some don't. I I'm not a big fan of it and um, I thought I would get away with it by cropping down my images but I honestly do not like um, the the effect of it so I wouldn't recommend this camera um, at all what I would recommend is an earlier generation GoPro which has, has gone down in price and it will do so much of a better job than this will do the other thing about it is downloading my images from the SD card it's just a hassle to to plug in cables and either take out the card and plug it into my computer whereas with the latest GoPros they're Wi-Fi enabled and so you can just stream your 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 footage onto your computer without wirelessly basically and you will find links below for GoPros that um second first generation second generation and um at a better price point than this which which is actually not even worth going into all right so it does work it does function you will get footage but what i'm saying is you won't get high quality footage with this thing all right this has been victor on the let me explain show thanks so much for watching and we'll catch you in the next one